Hi guys, it's Julia or Small Pocket Big World and today I am leaving for Boston. I am going to Boston this weekend because I want to visit my friends of course. I graduated from college a semester early and I still have friends that are there and I'm also going for the weekend this weekend specifically because it is Marathon Monday and it's a big thing at BU like everyone parties all day so this should be a really exciting and beautiful sunny weekend in Boston. The reason I'm bringing so much luggage for the weekend is because I'm actually going to Brazil from Boston so I'm gonna be away for two weeks so that's why I have like a carry-on basically. Another quick note I work a nine to six but the reason I'm able to be away from home for two weeks or 10 working days is because I work fully remote. So remote work for the win if you want to travel more. I'm still not a pro at vlogging in public, but the check-in was painless. I just had to check in one piece of luggage. It was one pound overweight, but the dude was like, it's fine. And then security was fine. And now I'm waiting at my gate. Uh, my flight was delayed 45 minutes. The dude next to me just walked away, so <laughs> maybe this vlogging in public thing is not the best, but whatever. I think I start boarding in like 45 minutes. I don't know, but I'm arriving in Boston like an hour later than I expected, which is fine because it's not like I had plans tonight anyway. I just landed in Boston. That was a really bumpy flight. I have to go get the bag I checked now and then I'm Ubering to a dorm at BU called Stuvi because my old apartment is there. My old roommate is going to let me in and I'm just going to chill for this tonight. I arrived in Boston last night and I was just catching up with my former roommate. Went to sleep. I was sleeping on the couch, but I just woke up. It's like 6 a.m. I'm probably going back to sleep until 8. But I wanted to watch the sunset, the sunrise. I never went back to sleep. After watching the sunrise, I just came back and kept working on small pocket big world stuff. Then I took a shower and I'm gonna be leaving soon from Stuvie to walk over to where I'm getting my test on Newbury Street. Um, after that, I have a full day ahead of me. I have brunch in that area. I'm going to Davis Square with one of my friends. I might go out later. I really don't know, just taking it one moment at a time. This is also my old apartment where I lived my junior and senior year. That was my room. But it's locked. No one lives in it. It's literally just my two old roommates and it's a four person apartment and it's just them. COVID test is quick, literally in and out. And it's the PCR test, but it doesn't go like all the way up. It just goes like in your nostril, super quick. And I should get the results back on uh, by Monday, like this time Monday. So that's good. I'm in coffee square now, but I was chill. It is very busy this weekend because of the marathon. I feel like half the people are walking, the other half are running. Like there's so many runners out today. I just walked down Boylston, like past the finish line. It's super cool. And it's actually my goal this year to run a marathon. So it's just like cool to see like all the energy in the air is making me emotional. <laughs> Not like in a bad way. I'm just like getting teary. Like it's just like a lot of good vibes.
I'm on my way back from Newbury Street. I'm going back to Stuvie. I'm gonna go hang out with my friend Jameson. Um, she might be in a meeting, I'm not sure. Um, I'm gonna have some food and figure out what my plans are for the night, so yeah. It's been 24 hours since I've last vlogged, so I want to update you guys. I've just been spending the past 24 hours chilling in Stuvie, which is like that apartment building thing on BU's campus. Just hanging out with friends, whatever, I got ready. And I'm walking to meet my friends for dinner at this restaurant called Barcelona Wine Bar. I've always wanted to go, so I'm excited to go. Tonight I'm seeing my friends that I met my freshman year. Uh, we all lived on the same floor and we're still friends. And like four of us are still friends. And two of them have boyfriends, so it's here with six of us. So I vlogged last night when I was on my way to dinner, and dinner was fun, but now it's like not even 9 a.m. And today is Marathon Monday, Patriots Day, a holiday in Boston, and I'm on my way to the frats with girls in my sorority. Um, <laughs> I'm only going to stay for a little bit. I'm going to go to the finish line, but yeah, I've already had a lot of, ooh, a lot of champagne. I have more champagne. I'll survive. I'll make it to the flight. I just want to do my last clip for this vlog because I never finished off my weekend in Boston. Marathon Monday happened. Drank a lot, of course. Um, but not too much. Uh, I got to see the finish line and everything. I made it to my flight. All was well. Um, and then the whole flight process was easy to Rio. Um, just three flights. I slept on all of them. And yeah, I've been in Rio for about 24 hours now. Thanks for watching this one and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!